Hello there, welcome back to the new tutorial video. In this video, we will be seeing how to do count if in Power BI. So here I'm having a simple sales table, wherein having the sales order, product name, and the quantity of those products. So let's get started with the video. First of all, what we will do is we will create a measure to count the sales order where sun product is equal to sunglasses. So this is our count if condition which we want. So let's create a new measure for that. I will click on the three dots over here and click on new measure. I will name this measure as count of sunglasses. Let me increase the size of this measure. Okay. So now I will use the DAX function. So here we cannot use the count if function because there is no such function in DAX. So instead of using count if, what we will do is we will use another alternative function for that, which is calculate function. And we will specify the filtering condition which we want to apply in this calculate function only. So here, when you will write the calculate function, it will ask you for the expression or the aggregation which we want to perform. So I want to count the sales order. I will close the bracket. And then here next you have to specify the filtering condition. So the filtering condition would be that the product is equal to sunglasses. I will close the bracket and then I will hit enter button. So here in this measure, what we are doing is we are giving it an expression which is counting of the sales order and then we are specifying the filtering condition wherein we are specifying the product is equal to sunglasses. Now let's add this in a text in a card visual over here. I will just drag and drop it over here. And as you can see, it is showing us three sunglasses. And here we are having three sunglasses in this table. Now let's perform another operation. Now what I want is I want to calculate the product or the sales order wherein the quantity is greater than six. So again, what you have to do is you have to click on these three dots and click on the new measure. Again, you will use using the same DAX function, which is calculate. And then we will specify the condition that we want to calculate only the sales order where the quantity is greater than six. I will name this as count more than six equals Calculate. Now I will do the expression to count the sales order. I will close the bracket. Then I will give the filtering condition that here the quantity is greater than 6. And I will hit on enter. So this is the next measure which we have created. Let's drag and drop it again in this card visual over here. So this measure has been created. I'll just select this. Let me drag and drop it over here. So here we are getting six sales orders wherein the quantity is greater than six. So in this way, you can use calculate function and by using the calculate function, you can do the operation which you would be doing by using count if in Excel. So as we are not having the count if function in DAX, you can use an alternative which is the calculate and then specifying the filtering condition which you want. I hope you learned something new from this video. And if you have any doubts, you can let me know in the comment section below. If you really loved watching this video, do like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching.